Hi everyone, my name is Nuno and today I'm here to teach you how to install Real Head Motion. So many people have been asking me how do I get the head motion effect when I'm steering the car or um, which settings do I use with Real Head Motion and even how to install Real Head Motion. So in this video I'm going to explain you how to install Real Head Motion and, we, I'm, and I'm going to show you or give you which settings I use. So first, I want to thank to Magic FR by creating for creating a real head motion. Okay, let's start with this. So the description for this page is in the uh, sorry, the link for this page is in the description below, where you can check out everything about real head motion, and I recommend you to read all this. So if you have any problem, you might solve it just simply by reading all this. Okay, you also have the explanation of every settings you can tweak inside of Real Head Motion. And I'm also going to explain you how to install the 64-bit version to work with Acero Corsa 64-bit version. Okay, so I'll give you, I'll provide you a link in the description with all the programs, all the files you need to get Real Head Motion working. So just download this file which is in the description below, as I said. Extract this file, open it, and you'll see you have two folders, a FreePy folder and a Real Head Motion AC folder. So start by opening the FreePy folder and start by installing FreePy. So I'm going to install FreePy using the path I want and don't forget where you install it because you'll need to know where you install FreePy. Okay, so install, say yes, this is pretty fast. And now I need your attention. If you run Acero Corsa uh, in 64 bit mode, you need to copy this file to the folder you have installed FreePy. So I repeat, if you have if you run Acero Corsa in 64-bit mode, you need to copy this file. If you run in 32-bit mode, you don't need it. And I'm going to show you later. Uh, I'm going to show you uh, how can you see which version do you use of Acero Corsa. If it's 32-bit mode or a 64-bit mode. Okay, I'm going to copy this file to the folder of FreePy because I run Acero Corsa in 64-bit mode. Okay, copy the file. I'm going to replace the file because I already have this file from other FreePy installation. I already had FreePy. So, copy this file, the NP Client 64, and the real head motion should work with Acero Corsa 64-bit mode. Okay, since we've done this, let's open now the Real Head Motion folder. And let's start by executing or running the, the Real Head Motion Acero Corsa file or program. Okay, you'll see the console pad and script pad are not set, and you also might don't know what this is. I'm going to explain you, don't stress out. Uh, these are the settings of real head motion uh, as I said in the forum page there is the explanation for everything uh, here and there and okay so I'm going to close this and you're going to notice that this file have been created these are the settings of real head motion so this file saved all this since I've already have my settings, I'm going to delete this and I'm going to copy these settings. These are my settings, these are the settings I use in my videos. So if you want these settings, just copy this file. Or check out in the description below the link for some pictures of my settings. Now I open I open it the real head motion, I said of course, and you saw that real head motion minimized. So it minimized because I said start minimized. And now you see my settings. 
these are my settings and the console pad and script pad are set uh, using my settings so you will have to click here if you installed a the free pie in other location so just simply click here go to your free pie folder you where you have installed free pie open the free pie folder and click on free pie.console say open and then you'll see your console pad now for the script pad the script pad is in the files I've I've just provided you or uh, the files you've just downloaded so go to real add motion folder real add motion again and AC I said of course real add motion dot PI now you open this PY sorry sorry my English it's not really good so excuse me um, okay so everything is set and if you go to open debug window if you check this uh, this window will open and you'll see FreePy started, stopped and start timer whatever and if it's uh, if the last line says uh, FreePy started everything should be alright so now I'm going to execute a Acero Corsa and I'm going to show you how do you see if you're uh, running Acero Corsa using 32-bit or 64-bit so let's wait a bit for this and I remember you that I recommend you to read all this so you can understand everything about real ad motion and how it works or even solve any problem you might have so this should be faster okay not going to cut this part of the video but okay pretty fast okay um, I'm going to options and I'm going to general you'll see here force 32 bit checkbox and I'm going I'm not going to check it because I wanted to run it in 64 bit mode so this is just a setting to make the run uh, make the game run at 32 bit but now I'm going to show you how you can really see which version are you using so I'm going to start the game I'm going to load the track and the car and you will see here, in this corner, right here, a Cero Corsa Steam 64-bit. If, if it's running 32-bit, it won't say nothing. If it's running 64-bit, it will say 64-bit. Okay, so now I'm going to, to the track and I'm going to steer the wheel. And you will see the head or the camera is turning with the steering wheel. So this is real head motion working. I'm going to make a lap and talk about this car a little bit. So enjoy me. Enjoy enjoy me. What? Enjoy the car on the track. Enjoy the lap. I'm going to try to make a clean lap without any pins or crashes this car is really hard to drive without without any assistance so you see real head motion is really working good it's pretty nice really wide here car just under steers uh, or oversteers also oversteers much but the understeering is also a problem with this car since it's too light okay uh, this car is being made it's uh, it's in progress the work is in progress uh, the car is still in development I'm working on it with other people um, more details about the car or where you can test the car how can test the car or uh, I, I don't know maybe yes some details will be in the description about this car how you can test it the car is still in beta test uh, it's not finished of course you see the LCD it's still pretty pretty bad um, the materials of the car are also pretty bad right now in this moment uh, I'm just trying to do things uh, one by one I'm only 
one working on the car I'm, I have other people giving me ideas or explaining me how to make stuff so I'm really only the one working on this the physics are not done by me that's the only thing and the model is not it's also not made from scratch so everything will be in the description uh, to to have the mod or test the mod how you prefer so okay let's uh, stop talking about this I'm not really good speaking in English it's even worse in English so um, okay so this was a lap uh, using real head motion you saw it's 64 bit it's working you can also get it working you have the settings you have the files you have everything working if you have any question or any problem don't mind to ask or say it in the comments below and I think that's all so enjoy bye